Hey, Sigrid Vokil here. Today, I'd like to show you how to edit, export, and upload high-quality Instagram IGTV videos using Final Cut Pro the fast and easy way. So it is March 2019, and let me tell you this. Instagram is where it's at right now. If you're a wedding videographer or a corporate videographer like me, and you have lots of videos created in the past and you want to showcase that, you might want to jump on to Instagram. However, you know, a regular Instagram post only allows you to upload up to 60 seconds of video max. So this might not work if you're trying to showcase your wedding film portfolio or corporate work because most of the time, you know, they're longer than a minute. So good thing that they have IGTV now. You are now allowed to upload up to 10 minutes long. For larger accounts and verified accounts, they can upload up to 60 minutes long. However, uploading your videos, let's say from Vimeo, YouTube, or from your computer, it is not as straightforward as it is due to IGTV limitations. If you try to force upload a video that doesn't fit their requirement, IGTV will just give you an error and it won't go through, okay? So the main requirements are as follows, right? A video, video should be vertical with an aspect ratio of 916. So that is equivalent to 1080 by 1920. The video should have a minimum rate of 30 FPS. So if you have a 24 frame rate, 24p frame rate, you can just export it to 30 FPS. The maximum file size for the video is around 650 megabytes. The file type must be MP4 file format. So if you have other formats such as MOB file, it won't let you upload it. So you need to prepare your video in that format. For us full-time videographers, that is extra work. And there is no one quick solution to this as of right now. But the solution that I'll be teaching you is as fast, as easy as it is already. We're going to use FCPX, Final Cut Pro. We're going to edit it, export that, and then upload it from our computer. Trust me, I don't want to do the extra work as well. And if I can do things as fast as I can without compromising quality, I will do it. So let's jump into the screen. First thing you need to do, you need to create a project for IDTV. Um, the key is to have that uh, vertical orientation. So I'll show you that. So first you go to new, then you go to project, and then um, put in a title, for example, for um, a video for IGTV, okay? And then now you're gonna go here. This is the most important part, okay? So you're gonna go to um, custom, on under video, you go to custom, and then 1080, right? Um, and then 1920, all right? As you see, I just switch it up, okay? It used to be 1920 by 1080, but we're going 1080p uh, by 1920, all right? The frame rate, um, you make it 2997. Um, if you have 20, 20 the, if your video is 23.97 uh, 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 frame rate, um, I don't think it will matter. Um, but the thing is, IGTV wants you to upload a 29.97 frame rate. Um, that's the minimum. That's from their requirement. So I'm just following that. It's up to you what type of codec do you want to use. But for me, I'm just going to leave it as is. Um, okay. And then I'm going to go ahead and, and hit OK. All right. So now you have the project. The next thing you need to do is to import that video. After you create the project, you're going you're gonna to have to import your file to FCPX, all right, Final Cut Pro. So now I have the file, and then I'm just gonna drag it here, right? Okay, so as you can see, the video is still in horizontal mode. Um, the key here is um, is rotating that, as, as, as you recall, as we recall here, IGTV wants it in vertical mode, and this is the key uh, for IGTV to accept your video, okay? So now, what you're gonna do is you go here, to transform, rotation, you're gonna make it 270 right okay you can also make it 90 if you want is that right yeah you can make it 90 or 270 it's up to you okay for me i make it to 70 all right so now you see here it's not fully uh it, it doesn't fit exactly on the screen right so there's the, the, so there's another step that you need to do after this so you go rotation right and then you go to spatial conform it's right here and then the type, uh, special conform, and then here the type, and then you go click on that, and then you go none. Voila, all right. Um, I've seen a lot of videos, they're trying to do scaling and all that stuff. Um, I think uh, some Premiere folks are doing that, but in FCPX, all I gotta do is do a special conform, and then type none, okay? So I don't have to do all that scaling stuff, I don't have to put in that number, um, it just, 
you know, does it for me, okay? All right, so now you have that vertical and now we're ready to export it and um, ready to upload for Instagram, IGTV. All right, so now you go to file and then you share, right? And then you go master file. Um, if you have compressor, you can send it to compressor and make your own settings. But um, for the sake of this tutorial, I would assume that you guys don't have uh, a compressor. So you go to share and then you go to master file. Okay. Now, IGTV wants you to upload it in MP4 format. Okay. So you go to settings, right? So the default, all right, if you go here by default, it will tell you like video audio, right? And then if you go, if you look underneath, it's going to say .mob file. Unfortunately, IGTV won't take the .mob file, okay? So what we're going to do is you're going to go to format, and then you're going to go to publishing, and then computer, okay? And then you pick a video codec, whatever you want. I mean, it's, it's you know, faster encode works for me. Um, better quality works for me as well. So let's pick better quality. All right. So we get we get the better quality of the video, um, and then the resolution. Uh, the resolution is going to be 1080 by 1920. All right. So pick the resolution. So this is the key here, right here, the the format and then the resolution. So for the codec, um, it will work. Both of them will work because it's just going to be shown on the cell phone. So it's still going to have a good quality. Okay. So those are the keys, all right? Do nothing, um, audio file, AAC. As long as you have the .mp4 file, you should be good to go, okay? Um, you go to next, and then of course, you wanna save that. Um, you wanna save that on your uh, on your computer, okay? So video for IGTV, so you're gonna name the file, video for IGTV. I'm gonna put one in there, so we can remember, okay? And then you go save. All right, and then now just wait for this to finish. Um, it will export and then we're ready to upload it. That's it, we're ready to upload it to IGTV. Okay, now after saving the file, we are now ready to upload it to Instagram on the same Mac, okay? And then log into your account, okay? So Instagram, all right, so now you are logged into your account, okay? So that's your, oh, so this is my wedding film account rev6 studios all right so what you're gonna do um is you're gonna go here to igtv okay all right igtv and then you will see like an upload uh button here and then you're just gonna click that there you go so this is where you drop the file all right so let's drop in the file okay so this is the one that we just saved boom there you go and you can edit the cover photo if you want, you know, or you can just leave it as is, all right? Um, you have a couple of options here, all right? So the details, you're gonna go corporate work, all right, sample, okay? So I just put in, and then you can put in the description um, um, if you want. Uh, so you, you you have the option here, you can also make it visible on on, on the Facebook page, if you want, if, if it's connected to your Facebook page, um, you can upload it as well. Um, and then if you want to review the video requirements, you just click here, okay? But we already talked about that, okay? So if you have uh, the vertical orientation, the key here is to have the vertical orientation. And then next is to have the video uh, uh, format to be mp4 file all right so it doesn't right now it doesn't take mob file so i just tried it okay so um, who knows in the future they might fix it and they would take more uh or different codecs but um as of right now they're only taking the mp4 file okay so what you do next is just you know click on post and then it will just upload um on your igtv okay so of course you just have to wait um it's gonna upload and then there you go. So it just shows up on your IGTV. Okay, so there I talk about how you can edit your videos to the right orientation. I talk about how to export your videos properly so IGTV accepts it. And then finally, how to upload your videos from your, uh, from your Mac, right? I know that this is an extra work, but I'm pretty sure that IGTV will come up with a faster way or an auto-rotate feature so that all we have to do is just upload it. But for now, this will do. If you find this video valuable, hit that like button or subscribe because I will be putting out videos to make you video creators out there 
life easy. So see you next time.